Hi, Simon. Good morning. Hi. Um, so thanks for joining us, joining me today. We doing. We just started a new series, video chat series with as Artists Open House, and uh, you're our first guest. So oh, welcome. Great. <laughs> um, um, so just um, starting with a few questions. And um, first of all, how, how are you? How how is everything going with, with you? these days uh, i'm i'm very good thank you um i'm uh, sheltering pretty much uh, keeping out of harm's way uh, i'm quite uh, busy doing my work I, if anything i'm doing more of my work than i used to um and uh although obviously uh you know i miss um there's a lot to miss you know like meetings and exhibitions and all that kind of stuff but uh, I'm managing pretty well thank you fantastic so we've been kind of seeing as AOH uh, catching up with what open house artists are doing during this time and um, your video blogs took our attention so maybe yeah. we can start a little bit of how and why did you start making videos um, uh, well, I started for quite quite a few reasons. Um, uh, one, obviously, the main reason is because of the lockdown, and because um, the open house was um, was was postponed. Um, but also, I've been um, I'm quite a social media enthusiast, and I've been sort of researching it and looking at a lot of marketing uh, videos, and everyone was. You know, several people said you must do either blogging or video blogging and I did try blogging um, you know I, I do like writing but um, I couldn't settle to it and I couldn't do it at the the kind of regularity and pitch that uh, they were suggesting you know people were suggesting you know once a week or more to write a blog and I just cannot work right at that rate I think it's um, it's incredible how video kind of took over uh, every every online space because it, it, it suddenly ended up the almost like only way that we can connect and it could go either either way it could go really well or it could go really wrong and not necessarily everyone really likes it and it is quite a strange thing, isn't it? You you see yourself as well as yeah, yeah. yeah well. I mean, the, well, the, you know, the, what the great thing and the worst thing about video is that it shows everything, you know. So if you're having a bad hair day, you know, it, it really shows, you know. Or if you if you um, stutter or stumble, or you know, it's it's there. I mean, I my videos are full of ums and ers, but actually, it's um it's quite a uh, it's, a, it's a cheap and immediate medium, you know, so it's, it's in a way it's very throwaway. So, it, you know, it doesn't cost much to do once you've, once you've got the basic equipment, and I mean basic, you know, just an iPhone. Um, yeah, so, uh, you know, that, that um, you know, it, it really, if you just start doing it, you'll, you'll, you'll pick up the kind of magic of it. Um, you know, and you will make mistakes, you know, and, it, and that's okay because you can just do it again if, if they're terrible mistakes. If you look, you know, you can either edit, edit them out or you can just do the whole thing again because I'm doing short videos, you know, well, five minutes. That's what I think is short. Um, but you can, you know, other people are doing one minute videos. I think it's, it's important that we can kind of move it. It's almost, um, what do you think that, important things to remember when you're making video just in case if you know well you might just find it difficult yeah i mean the, the important the important thing is not to not to get over grand about it you know just start just try it that's that's the main thing you know and um you, know, you can it is worth thinking about you know do you want to um, just talk because that is absolutely fine. And that's what most people do. They just talk about what's on their minds. You know, so it's like, um, 
like a monologue or one one side of a phone conversation. Are you working on anything at the moment? Uh, yeah, um, I've got a piece here which um, I can just show you or try and show you. Yeah, so it's a still life. So it's a collection of objects and it's a mixture of kind of um, architectural elements and kind of organic and suggestive elements. And this will be, um, they're all made of separate objects, so they're not actually stuck together yet. Put the glaze on this and fire it, it's the glaze that will stick it all together. As part of video making and your video blogs, I was wondering if any way that, you know, making videos changed the way you think and, and work? Yes, I think so. I mean, I think it's, um, it was a long, deciding to make the videos was a long process. You know, I've actually spent a long time, you know, like about two years changing my attitude you know, so that I could do this. Uh, you know, and I don't recommend that, but, um, you know, I, I, as I said earlier, you know, I recommend that people just do it, get started. Um, I mean, I, you know, it's, it's actually given me quite a lot more confidence, you know, about talking about my work. Um, it's, it, it is, you know, video works so well on social media. It, it's a real natural fit. So it, I feel like I've got some content that really suits social media, you know, which is nice, you know, because I wasn't I wasn't so comfortable writing blogs as I am just talking about my work. You know, that really um, it comes very naturally to me. So, so yeah, I think it it has helped 